and let's get to There's a lot of going on today, even yesterday, and we're moving indeed from the high political level to more technical level, which really is the purpose of this uh, 14th World Forestry Congress. The NGOs, or civil society, and the private sector are the main... This morning we had a plenary session on resilient uh, economies and resilient societies, so that brought the climate change issues, uh, disaster, uh, disaster risk management issues, and the society's communities' resilience on the map, which is one of our strong messages here. We then broke to a tree talk, which is a TED talk version, uh, of having a monologue on stage giving some perspective and in that case uh, myself as Secretary General gave a bit of a perspective on work, employment and dignity and we drew it to the program we have in South Africa, the Working on Fire program and how that contributed to addressing youth unemployment in Africa. So six months after uh, Matric I joined the Working on Fire program they were looking for female firefighters and I was the first to join in town as a firefighter. As someone that is from a rural area, you can grow through the program with, with nothing. From nothing to where I am today. It's quite an important event for us to in fact reflect on what are the specific issues that confront Africa in terms of the forestry and sustainable development. In this case, I think the meeting has had a very good preparation. The African Forest Forum, which was meeting here since the 4th of September, Friday, Saturday and Sunday, they've actually had a meeting where Africa got together to actually consider some of these issues. So we've had a good foundation, if you like, laid in terms of preparation for Africa. And this is really the, the climax of, of, of having to put a firm African footprint on this Congress. I think your enemy's border because I think that people are so tired of hearing the same thing from so many NGOs, from so many organizations, sustainability, sustainability, and you kind of, you know, it's just an ongoing record. We have to find a different conversation to have. These challenges are obviously fairly different from North Africa to South Africa and the East and the West, but yet that, that's, a, that's a kind of a regional perspective to this Congress, given that it is the first time ever that the Congress is in the African continent. Everyone is extremely happy, in fact, they're quite clear that, that this will be the best World Forestry Congress ever. I would say we are very much on the right track. I'm impressed of the participation. People are bringing a lot of new ideas, new innovations to this Congress. So I, I certainly think we are, we are on the right track and I'm intending to keep that track until the very end.